No intro for this game. None. You don't get it. Phillies lose 3-1 to one to the Washington Nationals. I don't even feel like setting up. I don't feel like making this video at all. But I am. I'm here. So, here we go. I'm going to sit down for this. This is going to be the Hector Neris rant, okay? Phillies lead 1-0 going into the ninth inning. We are two outs away from winning when Hector Neris allows a two-run home run. He then, on the very next pitch, allows a solo shot. Why do you not take him out after the two-run home run? Why is he still in the big leagues after he has choked away at least three games this year, almost, it feels like? He is the next Mitch Williams, and I know Philly fans do not like Mitch Williams. Now, here's my solution. There is a guy in the minor league system for the Phillies right now that, uh, I forget his name. He wears number 44. I think it's Pedro Bito, actually. And why not bring him up? Because he has, like, 48 saves already. Matching Bradley would be matching Bradledge, um, uh, his 2008 total. Anyways, why not bring him up? Also, I was watching MLB Network yesterday when I noticed a familiar face in the bullpen. He took his glove off and moved it from his left hand to his right hand. And I said, oh my god, I did not realize this had happened. Now, the Phillies apparently got rid of Pat Venditti, and now he's on the Dodgers, and he got like a 1-2-3 inning, and I'm like, Bob McClure told me a few, I don't know if I ever told you this story, I was at a Phillies game, and I had just gotten back from seeing an Iron Pigs game, I got that hat, and Venditti had pitched that game, and he did so well, and then... I asked Bob McClure, when is he coming up? And he said, never. I'm so done with this organization.